When North Posey takes the field this weekend, it'll be their fifth time in a semi-state game with a chance to make it to the state championship, and that'll be for the first time since 2005. The Sherry McBroom up in Poseyville and says the Vikings up for the challenge. From the start of the season, the North Posey coaches have allowed the players to make the goals for this team. And after winning a sectional title and a regional title, there's only one game that stands in their way of their ultimate goal on the season, and that's an Indiana State Championship. The ultimate goal for any high school team is to win a state championship, but not many teams get close enough to almost reach out and touch it. That's the opportunity North Posey will have on Saturday when they take on Southmont. They're going to rely heavily on the run game, and, and they've... Uh, They've used that to get to where they're at. So, you know, I, I know sometimes the record can be deceiving, but they uh, they are a legit, uh, really good football team and uh, well well deserving to be in the in the two A state or semi state. For senior quarterback Liam Stone, he and other seniors know how difficult this game will be, but they always felt like this would be their year to make a deep run in the playoffs. Southmont's got a really good running back, Wyatt Woodall. We got a key off on him. They got a fast quarterback. We just got to stay level, watch a lot of film, and come to practice every single day. We've grown up together, man. Uh, we've been working since a very young age, and we knew, we've always known that this year was going to be our year. The Vikings have not been to the state final since 2005, and for them to continue this season, senior left tackle Cole Collins says they have to continue to work together and need their community support. Well, a lot of experience, obviously. I mean, we're, we're tight, I guess, as a group. We know our, our strengths. It's really awesome. Like, just seeing everybody want to come and come to the game and just be there, it's really great. One of the keys to their success this season is the fact that this team returned 21 of 22 starters from last season who have been through the highs and the lows all together. For us, it just started with managing expectations. We talked about that from the you know opening part of the season was we knew, um, you know, inside these walls here at North Posey that we had a shot of making a really deep run. Uh, we're kind of flying under the radar, which we liked, but at the same time, you know, we just wanted to focus on one week at a time, get a little bit better each week in practice, and uh, our guys bought into that. Now, North Posey coaches and players are expecting Joe Jingleball Field to be rocking come this Saturday, and I am told that Joe Jingleball himself, who coached at North Posey for 40 years, will be in attendance for that semi-state game. Checking in with North Posey Vikings, I'm just sure McBroom, Home Team Friday.